This oh my god, like what flavor, what? Hi, Hi guys. guys, welcome back to our channel. I'm Cal. I'm Ariel. And I'm from the UK. I'm from the US. We're in a long distance relationship and we haven't seen each other for a while. Coming back to recording, we thought we'd uh, sort of do a challenge kind of thing where we do US uh, food compared to the UK. So we chose out a few things and yeah, we can run down the list. So mm. we have very similar or the same exact foods and we just kind of do want to do a reaction based on taste, look, flavor, ingredients, all of that stuff. We have Doritos. We have salt and vinegar chips. The US brand is, is US. The US brand is Lay's and the Euro, I wouldn't say European, but the UK brand are mm. Walkers. It's, it's basically the same Lay's thing. Yeah. And then we have Cheetos. I have hot Cheetos, um, but we couldn't find hot what's it, so we just got regular what's it. Yeah, to be honest, we should have looked a bit harder, but I mean we we done enough. We tried. <laughs> <laughs> and then we have the same Twix, um, one from the US, one from the UK, Snickers, one from the US, one from UK. And then we have all these sodas. I'm wondering if you guys can see it, but we have Coke and Fanta. So No, you don't need to see it just yet. I want time. I want to start with the drinks first, though, because okay. I'm thirsty. Okay. So first we have the Fanta. So this is the UK Fanta. Mm. This is the American Fanta. So I'm pretty sure, like, I've seen videos all across like TikTok or Instagram just showing the difference. Yeah, that I don't know if the color difference is obvious enough on the camera, but. Uh... Do you know what we need to do? We need to go get the actual orange juice that's in the fridge and pour it out and you realize that is the color of orange juice. That is... Orange Fanta. Orange. <laughs> yeah, like, I mean, it's orange, but it's not what orange juice is. There's a few things that stick out to me immediately with this. Fanta Orange says the same thing on this. In big letters here, it says contains no juice. <laughs> His uh, brother pointed that out. Ours is made with fruit. So it's like, yeah, the, obviously the bottle size is also what sticks out to me. I have a bit of a gripe with these bottles. They, we used to have the sort of more traditional, oh, let me grab this cup. Uh, we used to have this sort of shape bottle and that was fine. Uh, they've now moved to this shape bottle. And if anybody from Coca-Cola is watching this, please change it back because it does not stand up in a cup holder. You know, if you're in a car and you've got your cup like holder here and you, you're braking or whatever, it, this bottle flies across your car like it's terrible. Whereas at least this will go in a cup holder. Just one of those things, but um, yeah. The ingredients are different too. So this is, in terms of sugars, um, it has 73 grams of sugar in this small little thing. and your daily value that you have on the nutrition facts is 143% of what you're supposed to have on a daily basis of sugar. Mm. How much is it on that Fanta? Does it show? Uh, I don't think it shows percentages. No, we don't does. do that. Well, it one. does. It says but this it's one. 22 grams of sugar in the whole bottle. Oh, okay. This one has 22 grams. Um, 73 grams of added sugars. Yeah. Mind this, you, it has no juice in it, so that would make sense. But. but this is a little bit bigger. I think it's like 91 milliliters, a little bit bigger. So this yeah. is 500 milliliters. This is 591. It's one and a quarter pints. Yeah. That. So we, you're working in Imperial, whereas ours are working in metric. The and calories... for those that say the Brits don't like use metric and only metric, we don't, we use both. Um, yeah, it's just one of those things. Um, the calories are pretty much similar. Uh, this one is 203 and this one is 270, which is, this is a little bit more, but let's drink it. Let's, I'm gonna open. Yeah, oh yeah. Actually, I want you to open it. I forgot it. we had to taste them. No, um, like I want you to open it and drink that one. Natural. Have you ever had Fanta before, like the US Fanta? I don't think I have. That is insane, 270 calories a bottle. Caffeine this one is 200, free. that's. Insane. I, don't, I don't see how that one it's can be 203. Chilled. This one is 500 milliliters. No, that's kilojoules. It's 48 calories. But that's in 250. So you've got... Ah, uh, I was doing it wrong, guys. I lied. So 250 plus... So 48 plus 48 is 130... No, 146. 48 plus 48. 
I, math is not my strong mm. suit. I think it's 140. I'll put, <laughs> I'll put, I'll put on the screen um, what the real calories are. I thought it was similar, but I'm really bad at reading European nutrition facts because I'm not used to it. But how long would that drink be? 96. That? I think this would be. No. Oh yeah, it, it would be like 106 or so. Listen, look, both of us are not good at math. It is 96 80, though. 96. It is 96. Yeah. He's good at math, apparently. Okay. Let's... It smells the same. Well, we'll see in a second. Uh, it definitely tastes like syrup compared mm -hmm. to that one. You know what that tastes like, Shirley? Mm -hmm. um, Fanta is one of my favorite drinks, actually. It does yeah. taste like it tastes artificial a little bit, Tim, like I the don't orange drink artificial. I'm going to say this about probably all of them, but I don't often drink a lot of sugary drinks and especially full sugar ones. I'll drink diet if anything, but I very rarely drink them. And when I do now, it tastes like there's something stuck to my tongue, like a, like syrup or something. It's, it it it's definitely like, has a very sugary taste though. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. And in Europe now we have these lids where they don't disconnect from the bottle. So it's for recycling or whatever. Uh, That to me is actually tastes like orange. Yeah. Whereas that tastes like artificial orange. Yeah, it does. That's what I'm saying. It like it tastes like orange, but like fake orange. That's much lighter, and it's like yeah, I can imagine sitting on a beach drinking that. Whereas that, I can just imagine sitting in a truck drinking that. Yeah, I mean, it does taste similar, <laughs> but this tastes trucks. a little bit stronger. Mm. And this tastes more like natural, whereas this tastes more like processed i would say in addition to tasting the fanta i would say we both agree that the uk mm. fanta wins out because it's a little bit more natural it has way less calories like i'm here thinking that this was 203 and this is 270 and it's actually 96 and 270 that is crazy because yeah. this is only 91 milliliters less Two, I mean more. You can fit two bottles into that. So this is the US oh, I don't Coke. Drink this. Even the British one I don't want to drink. I really don't like Coke. If you see me in my next video and I have spots all over my face, it's because I've touched Coke. Like, well, you can take a little sip or I can mm -hmm. taste it. So I know what this tastes like. Let's look at the nutrition facts okay, first fine. though. So this is 240 per, per calories, like per bottle. Here we go again, guys. <laughs> Let me see. Okay, so this would be 105 plus two. So, I mean, times two. Energy. That's 210. Are you looking at calories? 250 milliliters. I'm yeah, talking about the calories. Yeah, 210 and this is 240, so but it's similar. I like on the, this, to be honest, this one might do it too. Oh no, it's, yeah, kinda. Um, so on ours, on our lab bottles, we have like a nutritional thing that tells us the amount of salt, the amount of, um, hang on, let me get a close up, let's point in, but. Hopefully that focuses in um, and it shows you salts, sugars, saturates, fats, energy in it. And so it's easy to see. And if any of these, we have a traffic light system. So if anything's like, if anything's red, you know it has too much of it or more than your daily allowance. Green is obviously not so bad. Whereas in the US ones, I find it's a bit harder to work out what you have in it. It has percentages and like of what's in the bottle. It does tell you in grams, but uh, the only thing that's maybe quite obvious is the amount of calories it states on the bottle, whereas ours says it in I servings. Hate that. I hate that. And there that might be two servings. Like, so for example, the Fanta, uh, where is it here? It says there are two servings in this bottle, and so you have to times whatever is on that by two, and it's so it's a bit, I don't yeah. know. It is a good thing that people are recycling, but at the same time, it's more draconian, even though, like, in a sense of, like, we're not going to give you the choice to recycle. We're going to, um, we're going to do it for you. sometimes Which we'll make it easier for you. Yeah. You'll, you'll see it more. We'll make it easier for you. So I'm going to try the US. He's going to try the mm -hmm. UK version. Mm. Why are you smelling it? Does it smell weird? I think that should be part of it. It smells. Let me smell that one. Yeah, yeah that one doesn't have smell a smell. Those, this one has a smell. I feel like that one doesn't really have a smell. That or one's maybe... stronger. Really? It has a different smell though. <laughs> mm -hmm. mm. I absolutely hate Coke. I don't know why I bought this. Not hate it, but like I'm not a huge fan of Pepsi That's or Coke. That's much fizzier than I expected it to be. And then I'm coming 
I'm saying that coming from diet drinks, which is what to me it tastes the same. Yeah, I accidentally just take it all off. It tastes the same to me. <laughs> that smells more plasticky. I don't know how to explain it. Like more artificial. I can't even put this back on. You can. You... Why? Why? All right, so we're back to our normal scheduled program um, after we clean the couch or his version of cleaning yeah. the couch. So what's next? So we finished all the juice. We only had Fanta and Coke to really compare. Yeah, I don't actually know if I gave a verdict on those. Oh yeah, which- I can't really remember what they taste They like. all taste the same you to me for Coke. Oh, you've ruined the- Just I mean, be careful. Uh. Ooh. <laughs> we'll okay. be back again soon, We'll yes. be back. I need to wash my mouth out or something. <laughs> that, that Coke is disgusting. He it's like a, real, it's like a plasticky, like, I'm trying to think, it's like syrup. Like I can, I mm. have, you know, like that sort of smoky after, not really smoky, but like maple syrup, there's yeah. a certain taste afterwards. Like it's like that. Oh, while he drinks his lovely coffee, I'm going to show you guys. We it's have a tea, ladies and gentlemen. Tea? Yeah. Oh, I forgot. You're British, so not coffee, tea. Mm. We have Doritos. So this one's a little bit bigger than this one, but it's pretty much the same thing. Yeah. In terms of like packaging, as you can see, they're different colors, but one hat is... They called, might be a little bit crushed up. They've been in a suitcase. But, yeah. Um, one is called Cool Ranch and the other one is called Cool Original. Is so this that's your normal size different. bag? That's like a grab and go bag. Like a normal, that's one serving bag. Yeah, so that's, I don't think that's a one serving bag. That's a grab mm. bag. So it's like, that's a share bag. Ah, okay. Or like, well, not really a share bag. The share bags are big, but like, yeah. I feel like there's a bag smaller than that. I don't know how many, cal like, how many that, calories. To me, it's like a lunch pack bag. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So I just picked it up. The, the sizes are not comparable. I don't Yeah, think. we should have bought the same sizes, but um, we're lazy. I was going to say, the first thing that popped up to me is that, uh, well, to be honest, they're cheap. Yeah. Two for one dollar. Those were what? A pound. Yeah, so that's already like two and a half uh, minimum. And then the other thing that stuck out was you call that Cool Ranch. Whereas we call cool that original. Cool I mean, original. That's not, let's look at the calories. That's like nothing. Are they made in Texas? Where I guess. Our ears is made, I don't even know where it says it's packaged. Uh, it doesn't Guaranteed say it on fresh. Here. There's something um, about processed the food UK. that I find that sort of humorous. Or Dublin. Mm. Guaranteed fresh. I guess that means stale, fresh as in like, like it won't be stale when you open it. Yeah. But, but like, this is the calories one fifty. I can't read the calories. I'm so sick of this. Like the the yeah. That's one thing I'll give to Americans. Is look at the size of the text on the packet. I really hope this is focusing because I'm sorry for my shaky hand. Well, I'll post a screenshot. Yeah. This versus like. how small the text is on ours. And if you're thinking of like people who are more vulnerable in society that need to read these things, they might not have the best of eyesight. This one's 150. Whoa, the smell of, wait, hold up. The... It smells like normal tortillas. Those, chips. yeah, they smell like, then they, from what I think I just saw, they look different as well. Let me see. So, the smell from that, like you have to smell the bag to smell them. That, like, is like a slap in the face. Like, kind of, oh no, they do look the same, kind of. Those look a bit yeah, more they sort of smell well a little baked. bit different. Yeah, they have more seasoning. So if you can see That's this like, chip, <laughs> smell them to unblock your nose. Like, Hang on, let me find one that actually nice looks like chip. actually looks like a Dorito. Whoa! <laughs> look look at how it. much sauce is on that. Or sauce, like seasoning. Seasoning. Yeah. Well, hang on. I've switched the sides, but yeah, there's so UK, much more. UK, US. There's nothing on that. The and to be honest, that's the UK one. These might be the chips. I chips, crisps. You're having an effect on me that mm. I actually like because I do not like crisps. I mean, I guess these are not. I'm, I'm salivating, like trying to talk about Taste it. Taste him. <laughs> I'm not a huge fan of Cool Ranch, but this one is very slight. Like the taste is not. Like you don't pick up on the seasoning. What do you think? This. Uh. Like when you lick your lips or whatever, or like you get the powder, and like that's not a bad taste, but I don't like the taste of the actual. Mm. It tastes to me like cheesy. Like this, this, it's so strong that it's almost sort of like a cheesy taste. Whereas I feel like these are gonna be like a lighter. Yeah, since this is a little bit more heavily seasoned, you can taste the flavor a little bit more on these. 
But I feel it's like it's overwhelming. Like, those to me taste much nicer. They taste like actual. Let me start drinking this, please. <laughs> I have nothing else to drink. Yeah, I'm like, you. No. I, yeah, these ones I feel like I can eat. They're not too bad, whereas those just feel. They just taste overwhelming. Um, so that brings us to these Walker's salt and vinegar and these Lay's. Like we said, they're the same company. It's just that they name them differently. I always get confused when I'm in the UK because the, the blue, the blue packaging is cheese and onion. And I always like, oh, salt and vinegar. But really the green is salt and vinegar for the UK. And for the US, it's blue. I prefer the design. Yeah, I prefer this one actually because it really? shows like the salt and vinegar. Yeah, I prefer that. I was that. gonna say I prefer that design. Really? Like, to me, I, I know that maybe it's just me like growing up, but like I, know what these taste like based off the color of the packet if you get what mm. i mean like i associate that color with how they taste because i've grown up with that color this uh maybe i'm associating it with some of the like cheaper brands that like uh -huh. Oh, Let's see if they taste the same help. though. This one is 160, the calories. This 45, this is 45 grams. So this is, obviously it's gonna be more calories and it's 230, but um, a serving size of this, it doesn't say. Let's open it. This is how our chip British looks. Potatoes. States on the package. Are you guys known for potatoes though? Yeah, they are they're you? from Dublin, so mm. Ireland's known for potatoes. Yeah. For sure. I mean, not that they're British, but. These are thicker. Uh, yeah, these the, are a bit lighter. The British ones are thicker. These look like they've been bleached. Let me find another one. Yeah. Look potatoes at the color difference. Potatoes are yellow. Hold on, let's let's put. This is um. They yeah. look like papa dumps. They do look a little bit whiter. Definitely whiter. The U the U S ones are small. whiter. Let me taste. Okay. Uh -huh. Oh no, we're being interrupted. Hey guys, welcome to the second interval. We <laughs> so got, we're back. Got yeah, a little got distracted. A, yeah, I had some family visits. They taste kind of similar. Um, but those to me are a lot milder. They are milder. And the chip is thicker too. So on which? On that one. Yeah. Seems a little thicker. Hmm. I love salt and vinegar is my favorite. So either yeah. one. They're a lot stronger. Yeah. So maybe, maybe it's the difference in where the potatoes come from. I think I prefer the, my Lay's because that's what I'm used to. I prefer these. But ones. I also like the fact that it's so much lighter, like the potatoes. Maybe they use a different potato, but I have a feeling it's for looks. I feel like it's a female thing, but you like light foods. Maybe. We have um, the next one is Cheetos and What's It. So unfortunately, we wouldn't be we couldn't find the hot What's It. But we yeah. got the regular ones. They do have hot watches. They also yeah. have prawn cocktail ones, which I thought were disgusting. <laughs> and they're so strong that I couldn't eat them. Like the, the flavor of these is strong compared to those ones. And the prawn cocktail ones were like a such like a such a sour level that I like I could only eat like two or three. Well, anyone who lives in the US knows that we have different types of Cheetos. We have like yeah. the Cheeto Puffs and we have the Cheeto Crunchies. I got the Cheeto Crunchies because I wanted uh, to taste So these them. are the small ones. My favorite, cr I'm not really a crisp person. I mean, I'll eat them occasionally, but these I think are my favorite. Maybe Skips. This oh my God. Like what flavor, what? I'd want, I assumed it would be this color, like, hold on, wait, let me open. Yeah, but the, the Cheeto Puffs look, look like, like that. The Cheeto Puffs look like that. Yeah, so our there. spicy ones look maybe a little bit more red than that, but like that. This is how it looks, and he's like... That looks like an intestine or something, like it looks... Taste it. They smell funky. Ow. They taste good. No, I don't like those. He's a picky eater, though. At all. What did they remind me of? There's another crisp. Mm -hmm. I um, wish I got the Cheeto Puffs, because these are They're kind of spicy, though. Let's try the Snickers. So these are Snickers. Basically, those are Snickers uh, as well. Chocolate. Basically the same. It What's looks the exactly tagline? the same. What's the tagline for Snickers? Because here, 
you, it's like you're like, not you if you're yeah, not hungry. Yeah, yeah, they do it for everyone. Yeah. But, but they have Rowan Atkinson, like Mr. Mm. Bean. Do I think it. they have different people. Mm -hmm. I imagine that I don't think he's as famous in America. Yeah. But like, first off, just rub like your finger down the side of the packet. Does does the chocolate not feel different through the packet? Maybe a little bit, but it could be how I don't know. To me, that one feels more like a. <laughs> it says it's only yeah, it made in the odd. UK, so it says UK only. So I'm guessing that this is just. Two hundred and fifty calories. This one's two hundred and thirty-eight, I believe. Yeah, two hundred and thirty-eight. That's interesting. Um, That's weird if the ingredients are the same. Artificial flavor is like the last ingredient on um, the US one. Uh, do they have that on the UK one? Is it, Dude, your guys is, does not have artificial flavor. I don't know why they're adding that to ours. The only thing I'd notice on that one is it says responsibly sourced coca as well. Mm. Whereas this one does not give up. Mm. They look identical. Pretty much the same. Even the bottom. Um, I'm not gonna be able to see it from that distance. But. It's the same in the inside if you show. He took a bite, I took a mm. bite. The only thing is, I'm wondering why this is more taste calories. Like chocolate. It doesn't taste like chocolate to you? No. Why does this have more calories than this one? It tastes the same to me. Mm. Does it smell the same? Actually, it does taste slightly different. Like now that I'm swallowing, the chocolate tastes a little bit different. So next we have the Twix. So this is the UK version. This is the US version. To me, it looks exactly the same. Oh, There's damn, nothing this different. Is the sugar one. They pack it's different. Like one's more gold. I don't actually know which one's which. This oh, is US. Ours is more gold. This one's the US one. How many calories? This uh, is 50 grams and it is... Count. Pull it open. I think it's 250. And 250. this is 246 calories. So we got slightly less. I d well, obviously it's not the same in the US, but in we now have a. Sh I hate taxes, but this, we have a sugar tax. So in other words, a drink that has sugar in it will be priced higher to stop people. How many sugars is in this one? 46. I no, don't hold know on. Where to look. Included sugars. sugars is 23 grams. Yours? Ugh. Does anybody else like shiver? It's like 24 yeah. though for you shiver guys. Shiver when you have too much sugar. Yeah, like, it's a little, that's open. Cookie. That's not a cookie. We're gonna start the whole, is it a biscuit? Is it cookie? Because what you call a biscuit, we don't, we call, what we call biscuits, you call cookies. And mm -hmm. what you call biscuits, we call scones. In and you know, uh, we invented them, so we're right. So, um, this tastes really different. It's like slightly off, I don't know how to explain it. Um, right off the bat, the inside tastes the same. Well, I haven't tried that yet, but from what I remember, it tastes the same. It's just the chocolate taste, yeah. The like chocolate ass. is off, it's different. I want to say it tastes like. But it definitely tastes different. Like what you think, mother? Oh my god! Let's <laughs> stop oh, that. I don't think we have any more. So um, oh, time for a nap. In the grand scheme of things, I think um, the UK might win out in terms of food, but our food laws are oh, wait, a little wait, bit wait. different. We'll do one last thing. What's uh, the one where last do we go? Thing? So we'll go back through what we had. Doritos. The Those UK. look better. Those taste better, mm -hmm. like the, the British ones taste better. I'm gonna put them like that. Then what did we try next? We tried the, those. I still prefer those. I prefer these. I can understand why you'd like those though. They are much lighter and not so like bang, like in flavor, like those ones are. I do prefer UK Doritos. I'll agree with that. Uh, and then these are not really compared, but like, yeah. I don't know. Maybe if those weren't the crunchy ones. They, they just, they taste similar to me. There's no difference. I don't see they went out. They do taste similar other than the chocolate. Yeah. I don't know about smell, but I think that again, that would be down to the chocolate. And to me, the chocolate just doesn't taste right. I'm not mm -hmm. saying it's right, but like it's, it, it would that always be the tastes same? like chocolate, whereas the other one tastes like chocolate with something in it or like something that sort of covers the taste. Would that be the same for the Twix? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Um, so the Twix And we forgot to do the drinks, but yeah. The Twix is, I think our packaging looks nicer. Yeah. 
a little bit more gold royalty. The red looks nicer on that. Yeah. Um, but the gold looks nicer on that one. And then the smell smells nicer. Um, Obviously, this the is a clear winner. This isn't even a question. It's this. that old. And the Coke. Coke. I hate both. <laughs> I'm That's, not a huge Coke fan either, um, so... No, well, yeah. I think the couch enjoyed it more than us. Yeah. Um, <laughs> okay, I don't know if there's anything the you want to see us try, whether it's drugs or, or fentanyl or... <laughs> no. <laughs> well, let's, let's rewind that back. Uh, so, yeah, let us know if there's anything you want to see us try. Thank you guys for watching. And if you like this video, don't forget to like it down below. Comment and subscribe. subscribe and, and hit yes. that bell notification. Yes, yeah. yes. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye.